Hey guys, this is Medico Man, and today we would be talking about some of the instruments used in the OBGYN department. We'll cover six instruments in this video today, and with time, other instruments will also be covered. So first, let us talk about the Sims Speculum. is a double-bladed surgical instrument used to examine the vagina and the cervix. It is entered into the vaginal canal from the lateral wall of the vagina. and then it slides into the posterior wall the patient has to be kept in the lithotomy position in this case we can also call it the sims position or should be kept with the knees flexed and the hips flexed as well over its back the speculum is so balanced that it rests on itself now let us talk about the anterior vaginal wall retractor As we pull down the posterior vaginal wall the anterior wall may follow and to improve the visualization of the vaginal walls and the cervix we go for the retractor it has a shaft two loops and the loops are studded with transverse grooves for better grip the valcellum the valcellum forceps are used to grasp the cervical lips and to visualize the cervix or during vaginal hysterectomy It is to be noted that valcellum is used only for hard cervix as soft cervix might rupture. The ovum forceps have a cup like depression and that is the major point to be noted. It is used to grasp, hold, manipulate and remove the tissue from inside the uterus including the ovum and placenta and hence to complete the procedures of MTP that is medical termination of pregnancy. A copper T hook A copper T hook is used to remove like the name suggests a copper T which is an intrauterine contraceptive device. We pass the hook into the cervix and towards the uterus and then we rotate it. Once rotated and when the hook is engaged we pull the uterine contents in this case the copper T out from the uterus. And finally we have the Simpson's uterine sound. The Simpson's uterine sound is commonly used for probing and dilating the uterus through the cervix. We are able to measure the uterine length by this Simpson's uterine sound. 